Let me show you how I made this beautiful infographic slide in Microsoft PowerPoint. So if you want to be an expert, watch the video till the end. Let's begin the topic. Here I have already taken a blank slide. Let me go to insert, go to shape, pick a rounded corner rectangle shape and drag it over here like this. Click on this and change the size 1.6 and Y 2.2 and this is perfect. Go to shape fill, make it no fill, go to shape outline, pick a outline color from here. Again go to shape outline, change the white to 6 point. Then press ctrl D to make it duplicate and place it here and press ctrl D to duplicate and again press ctrl D to duplicate. And let me select all of this and place it here and make sure the gap is same. If the gap is not same, just go to shape format go to align click on distribute horizontally then it will be perfect now again go to insert go to shape pick a rounded corner rectangle shape and drag it over here like this use this point to make it sharper and place it like this go to shape outline make it no outline go to shape fill and insert a fill color from here then select this one go to shape outline click on white outline go to shape outline change the white to six point and this is looking perfect then select this one press ctrl d to make it duplicate and place it here again press ctrl d to make it duplicate and place it here again press ctrl d to make it duplicate and place it here like this now select this one go to shape fill change the fill color select this one go to shape outline eyedropper and select this color then select this one go to shape fill change the fill color select this one shape outline eyedropper select this color and let me select this one go to shape outline change the outline color from here select this one shape fill eyedropper select this color and this is perfect now i have to add some arrow go to insert go to shape select the arc shape and drag it over here like this rotate it make it bigger and place it like this now select this one go to shape outline go to white change it to six point then go to shape format go to line and go to begin arrow type and select the arrow type this one and this is looking perfect you may increase the size you may use this point to increase the size and rotate it and this is perfect now press ctrl d to make it duplicate and place it here again press ctrl d to make it duplicate place it here go to rotate click on flip vertical and place it here like this now go to insert go to shape pick a text box and drag it over here and write your text here change the font and change the font size and place it here select this text go to text spacing go to more spacing and change it to 2 and this is looking perfect press ctrl d to make it duplicate place it here press ctrl d to duplicate again press ctrl d to duplicate and place it like this now double click on this right here one change the font and change the font size double click on this right here change the font and font size now let me select this one and this one press ctrl g to group them together this one and this one ctrl g group them together press ctrl g to group them together now i have to add some animation let me select this one go to animation click on wipe effect option from left duration 0.75 then select this one zoom this is will be after previous then let me select this one wipe effect option from left on click duration 0.75 then let me select this one wipe effect option from left this one zoom after previous 0.75 
0.75 then select this one y from left 0.75 then let me select this one go to animation painter click on this select this one animation painter click on this select this one animation painter and click on this select this one click on animation painter click on this select this one animation painter and click on this and this is perfect now let me watch the slideshow this is perfect so hope you found this video helpful if you like this video please share this video with your friends and family and don't forget to subscribe thank you